whether you are a beginner or a pro at editing videos for YouTube or any other projects, there are free editing video software for you. When I say free, they are completely free. So coming up, I'll list top five free video editing software for Windows, Mac, and Linux. And I'll be going over some of the pros and cons. Coming in at number five, Windows Video Editor. This video editor is completely free and has very friendly user interface and very accessible. This is because it comes pre-installed with Windows 10 and above. Honestly, this made my top 5 only because of how accessible it is. Let's jump into the video editor interface. Now if you have Windows 10 and above, all you have to do is come to the taskbar and click on search and type in the video editor. It's already pre-installed. All you have to do is click it and voila, this is the interface. So I already have two projects here, but I'm just going to click on new video project. And this is the, and this is the interface. I'm just going to type in three because I have two there already. Okay. And this is the user interface. This is the library right here. This is the, this is the preview video right here. And this is the storyboard right here. Okay. And for you to get started, you already know all you have to do is click on add you could add from this PC or this other two options but what I like to do is simply go to my folder click on the tool whatever I'm trying to edit or add to my storyboard or library all you have to do is drag and drop now I there any drawbacks yes there is it doesn't have a lot of features like the other video editing software is coming up has it has only one track layer this is only for simple videos and quick videos let's check out the number four on the list vsdc this is one of the best free video editing software with free and paid edition we are going to focus on the free edition which is features pat unlike the windows video editor with features like transition video and audio effect masking and motion tracking. It also allows up to focal resolution for the exported project. VSDC has more than just video editing features. Right here, you could select a project, create slideshow, import content, video capture, and screen capture, along with the top tutorial. To begin a project, you could simply click on start the project and you could click on the resolution and click on the framework that you want and just start. And here you could see the interface which actually looks very nice and decent. While VSDC is user friendly, it has a steep learning curve, but it has a how to section at its website where you can learn and begin editing. Coming in at number three is Shotcut. It is updated on a regular basis and it is completely free, just like the other video editing software and include a ton of useful features. It includes a lot of audio features like volume control, audio effects, and many more, including exporting of your video project up to 4K. The video effect include numerous transition effects and color correction, to name a few. It is also packed with ton of editing features with unlimited tracks for video and audio. Its interface requires a few learning curves to get used to. In addition, here is a shortcut website. You can watch tutorial to get familiar with shortcut software and begin to edit. Let's jump into number two, OpenShot. You can download this software at openshot.org and you could download it at any platform whether it's Windows, Mac, or Linux. This video editing software made it to number two because it has a very friendly user interface, yet packed with a ton of features comparable to paid video editing software. Some of the features it comes with are audio waveforms, flexible video effects, unlimited tracks, 3D animation, and the list goes on and on. I can't mention every feature it has, it's just a lot. 
and I don't even think it takes that much to get used to. If you have a basic video editing understanding, you could actually just start editing. As you can see, it has a very, very friendly user interface. It has the library, it has a video preview, and it has a timeline. All you have to do is drag and drop, drag and drop. It has the all the effects, the transitions, and everything that you would need to edit a video. OpenShot is actually a very good video editing software, but it isn't number one. Talking about number one, sitting at number one, the absolute best free video editing software, DaVinci Resolve. It is completely free with paid packages if you wish to add extra features, but it already comes with ton of features that rivals paid video editing software, which includes just about any features you will need to create any kind of project with unlimited timeline to editing, cut which is used for quick editing. It also comes with features like Fairlight which is specific to audio editing. Fusion color correction. Now let's take a look at DaVinci interface, which looks modern and looks kind of nice. This is the media page where you can organize your media just like you would organize your folders by creating bins. You could add media to bins and you could create however bins you want to create. Right after that is a cut section you can make a quick edit it's just where you can make a quick edit personally i don't actually use this that much and next is the edit page this is where you can edit your page to your liking it comes with a lot of features it has two screens where you could preview and drop or you could arrange it however you want you could drag and drop from screen to the timeline you could drag with audio or without the audio this is pretty easy and you could do whatever you like it also comes with features like transition effects animation and the list goes on it also comes with a unique fusion and color page this is where you can create cinematic quality visual effects and motion graphics DaVinci does come with a steep learning curve, but you can watch the tutorial videos to get acclimated with this software. DaVinci is available in all platforms including PC, Mac, and Linux. Thanks for watching. All links are in the description. Hopefully this video helped those of you who are searching for free video editing software. If it did, leave the thumbs up and share. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video.